Huh. Well... Well, how did the search for Shiba turn out? We, we were unable to find any sign of her. The seas are too rough to search. And there's no sign of her on land. Tobi is responsible for Shiba's fate. No apology can reflect the sorrow I feel at your loss, Farron. All we can do for Shiba now is hope. After all, nobody ever found the body. But tell me, what of Jenna and the others? Ah, well, we, you know, we couldn't find anybody. The same, we searched all over, but they're nowhere to be found. You know, we probably could have... You know, searched the bottom of the lighthouse and have seen if Felix and Shiba were alright or not, but... Yeah, the, the, ground tore apart, the, sh the ground tore apart from the shock of the lighthouse and the ship. Apparently, everything at Itajima, including the ship, was swept away. Everything? So, so, Itajima was washed out to sea. Yeah, it looks like that. Incredible. Then the cave, too, has been flooded. Yeah, I guess so. But we think Jenna and the others are still alive. They, they may have they may have washed out to sea with Itajima. We have decided to continue searching for Jenna. Haven't we, Isaac? No. No. We're done. <laughs> yeah, of course we have. Do not worry about Shiba. I just hope you are able to find Jenna. We'll find Shiba without fail. Maybe you could check by the bottom of the lighthouse. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. <laughs> After all, she's a kid that fell to the, to the earth from the sky. I'm sure she's fine. Maybe you can find Felix's body there, maybe. Maybe. Sheba's been in dangerous situations before and lived. I'm sure she'll be fine. But this time, I believe it was nothing short of a miracle. Who knew the sea would rise up to the lighthouse just as she fell? Wait, what? <laughs> I love how they just throw that in here. Um... Without showing it. <laughs> Can you really call that a miracle? <laughs> Do you think it was just good luck? L let's let's call it a mere coincidence for now. I'm not sure we should be calling it a good thing at all. <laughs> Nothing is coincidental when it comes to this child. She's not a Mercury adept. So you believe Shiba survived? Yes, I am sure of it. Just because Shiba was an adept? Huh. No, because she... Adept, what is that? I believe it's because she is God's own, own child. Ha! Huh. Well, it's, uh... It, it, it's someone with abilities like theirs. Huh, what abilities? I thought they were just good fighters. Huh. Isaac, you and your friends are truly amazing. Ha! Huh. You were able to enter the ancient ruins and get to Venus Lighthouse. Not only that, but there was a huge dragon on top that you fought. But Shiba was different. She couldn't enter the ruins. Is that so? That's just because Shiba's abilities are different from theirs. Oh, now you're telling me that there are these people with special abilities, and now you're telling me that they have different ones as well? You, sir, are crazy. No matter how many times I explain that to Ferran, he doesn't get it. Hmm. Garrett, Garrett, don't be rude. I'm not being rude. Come on, unfortunately, we don't have time to talk. We gotta go. We gotta go. Oh, that's right. I didn't mean to keep you. Well, you are keeping us. Come on. Th that didn't come out right. No, no, no. We, we mean, we, we mean while you were talking, Jenna and the others are lost at sea. I understand your desire to leave as soon as possible. After all, if I knew where Shiba was, I'd wa I wouldn't be here talking to you peasants anyway. <laughs> the seas have been very rough since the beacon was lit. Be careful. Oh, don't worry. We will. You too. Farewell. Take care and farewell. All right, now everybody else say farewell. There we go. Thank you very much. I hope your search for Shiba yields success. There we go. Everybody gonna say farewell. Oh wait, no, we do get to the We do get to take control. I forgot about that. Let's see what uh, he's got to say. Just wait for me outside for Ron's house. I wish to speak with you. I will. I will. In a minute.
Wait. <laughs> Where are you going, Isaac? I Iadem. Iadem, Iadem, whatever. That guy asked us to wait. Did you forget? Yeah. We're going to need to work on your memory, Isaac. Ha ha ha. We can delay our departure a little a little longer. Let's wait. I'm pretty sure we have to actually try to leave the area to have him come out, though. Thank you for waiting. <laughs> I can't wait for this to be over. Thank you for waiting for me. As you no doubt have guessed, I need to speak with you about Lemur Lemuria. Not this again. Yes, the, a the island of ancients far out to sea. When you could not find Jenna, we you returned to Venus Lighthouse. Yeah, the base of the lighthouse was flooded so we couldn't get out. And that's when you gazed out to sea. As you promised Bobby you would. Ah, yes. Yes, and we saw an area wrapped in mist. I remember how Bobby said Lemuria was always covered in mist. Yeah, and? I'm not sure, but I think I am beginning to think that may be Lemuria. If it is, then Bobby's life could be saved. Yes. Oh, well, I guess we have no choice but to go. Yeah. Good. Then it's settled. That's why I shook my head to settle that. Yes, you should go. I'll make arrangements for you to leave at once. But, but we have to find Jenna first. That is the other reason. I wanted to see you. To give you this. Ah, takes out the black orb. What is that? Oh, isn't that... You will need it to sail Babby's ship. I thought the ship we saw at Itajima was Babby's. Ah, okay. His ship is here in La Levera. Ah, so that was, uh... Saturos and Minardi's ship. Yeah, exactly. I forgot about that, actually. Perhaps, but we have no way of finding out that out now. Yes, we will in the next game, but um... Yes, they're gone. But now we can sail the ship of the ancients, exactly. It certainly will aid us in our search for Jenna. Bobby told me that the ship of the ancients is an incredible vessel. We'll make your search for Jenna easier. What, what's so special about it, then? But I want you to find Lemuria as soon as possible, so you know that the person that gave you this gift wouldn't, you know, die. <laughs> yeah, we get a few years, right? Right, he's got enough of that draft left on. <laughs> the ship is docked at the edge of town. You will know it when you see it. Aha! So that is what that uh, strange building that we could not enter was. Anyway, right on, Isaac. We can finally see it to see the ocean. You s- You've seen the ocean so many times. Oh my god. <laughs> to see we go. It is time to depart. Exactly, and look at it. Those soldiers are back on their feet. Look at them. Ha <laughs> ha, I thought they had done me in for sure, but I'm all better now. I will never let my guard down again. We will protect the ones. We will be the ones to protect La Levero from danger. Actually, I want to go in and check this because I don't think I have ever checked afterwards if they have anything new. Um, give me one second. That would be so cool if they just had like, oh, by the way, here's an even more ultimate weapon that you could have had. Uh, but no. No. Oh well. Anyway, that is it, guys. That is it. Except for this guy right here. I, I was told to let you in if you showed up. The door is open. Oh man. Oh man. No, we gotta see your thoughts on this. Because you've not even been in there. It sure seems like a strange place for Bobby Demora's yacht. Aha. Oh man. Gotta do one last reveal. Gotta see if there's any goodies in here. 
There aren't. <laughs> I've, I've, I know that. There's never been any goodies in here. Oh, maybe these barrels! Maybe there's these barrels! No, of course not. There's never... There's not gonna be goodies in here. I mean, what's the use of that? Oh man, this is it, guys. The Lemurian ship. You ready? Let's jump on board! Oh, let, let's raise it from the depths of the ocean first. There we go! This kind of seems like a dumb way to store a ship, not gonna lie. I mean, all the beds are soggy. Anything you stored, it's gonna be all gross and wet and salt and crusted. I mean, it might be a better way to store a ship. <laughs> Looks like it's finally time to leave Gondwin. Yes. Oh wait, I was gonna say, we already left Gondwin. No, this is the continent Gondwin. The other one was a different one. It's it's so strange. We've been traveling for so long. And yet it feels like we've only just begun. Now that I think about, about it, so many things have happened. That they have. But our journey will be over as soon as we find Jenna, right? Nope. What did you say? Our next journey? What journey is that? Our journey home. Come on. Also, you know, making sure the lighthouses aren't lit. You didn't forget, did you, Garrett? Our promise to Babby. Well, that, uh, that as well. Our promise to Babby. Oh, Lemuria! That thing, you know, where this ship came from. <laughs> I wonder what kind of place Lemuria is. We have to find Jenna before going to Lemuria, don't we? Yep, we do. Yeah, that's important. You know. Yeah, <laughs> I'm not even gonna say anything. At any rate, this will be our first time on the ocean. See, now... Ivan's got it right, Edward's Garrett! So this is the ocean creating one we you see! You're f <laughs> You're so dumb! God! Garrett! Oh my god! Who wrote Garrett's lines? The seas are very rough. Do you think we'll be okay? Yeah, we'll be fine. We've got a Lemurian ship. Exactly. Well, shall we? Yes, we shall. To see. Jenna is waiting for us. Let's go. Now, how do we fly this thing, or sail this thing, or what? <laughs> and they're just waiting there, awkwardly. <laughs> Forevermore. Oh, I guess it just goes on its own. <laughs> anyway, guys, that was Golden Sun. That was a Let's Play Golden Sun with Miox Fu. Oh man, I forgot how good these credits were, because they all look like they're hand-drawn and everything. Uh, it looks, it, they look neat. Actually, aren't these all, um... Yeah, these are the, these are the battle backgrounds, that's right. But anyway, this was a very long Let's Play. I think I've been doing it for, like, I don't know how many months at this point. Um... I do like this game. I do not love this game. That was the problem starting out. Because, I mean, you guys know I took a hiatus for a couple of months while I did <laughs> Resident Evil um, in the middle. Just because I was getting tired of this game. And I was actually thinking of just leaving it off for a while near the end as well, because I was just getting tired of the game again. But I, f I decided I should just finish it. And I think we're at, like, near 70 parts near 70 parts. That's a lot. That's more than I've ever done, I think. This is good music, too. The outro. The credits. Oh my god, I can't believe it's over. Finally, another LP over. This this was definitely not one of my favorite LPs, just because after a while, I just wasn't having fun. 
recording some of these, like, there were par parts, like, that was like, oh my god, I remember this, this is so awesome, but other than that, like, there are a lot of parts where I'm just like, oh, I don't want to do this, I don't want to play this RPG. But I feel like I got it back together in the end, and I feel like this place, once we hit Tolby, things got a bit better. I feel like I, I hit an area where my energy was renewed, where I just found a new joy in the game, and I, that made me very glad that I was able to do that. It is a good game. It is a, a remarkable Game Boy RPG that is not just a port of another RPG, like the Final Fantasy Advances or something like that. Um... I think it's a good example of how an RPG doesn't mean just party, or a JRPG doesn't have to mean just party-based combat, that you can have puzzles in it too, which I, I keep forgetting how much I love the puzzles in this. The puzzles are the best part of this game. The story is pretty basic. Um, there are these guys trying to bring back an ancient power, and we gotta stop them. It's, it's pretty basic in that regards. But it's a good game. And I don't know, like, at the end of the day, I'm happy that I did the LP. Because had I not done it when I did, I would have to do it at an, a later point. Also, save your game. You cannot resume your adventure with this data. No, I cannot. Because this is... Oh, this is... A save game plus 23 hours so about 24 hours all in, in all um, I'm gonna keep the lighthouse eerie but I'm gonna save over Coliseum final there are a couple things that I realized I didn't show in the LP as well after the fact that I that I wanted to but uh, oh well and here we go I think yep here we go. This is the uh, epilogue with <laughs> just a different color of water <laughs> going through the ocean. Oh my god, I haven't done your voice in ages, Jenna. I don't remember your voice. Oh, Craden, how long would this island continue to drift? Uh, um, I don't know. I, w I wish you could tell me. <laughs> Sheesh, you're no help in times like this. <laughs> A three-hour tour. Hey, I'm hungry. You want to... How can you think about food? I want you to go, you know, maybe get me some fish. Because I'm a sick old man. I wonder if I'm gonna die. <laughs> no. I, I wonder what happened to my brother. I, I can't be certain, but it looks like they lit the Venus lighthouse. It looks like they lit the Venus beacon. You don't have to tell me that. That's how we wound up adrift at sea, right? Right? <laughs> You're so cranky today, Jenna. Well, I suppose you must be worried about Felix. I would be too. Plus the fact that we don't have any fresh water, except for this little bit of water that's going with us, but... <laughs> Isaac and his friends must have been nearby too. They probably were. I miss them. Isaac. Felix. All those other people I never met. Aha! But who's this? There's something I wish to show you. Walk this way. Tell me to walk this way. Talk this way. Walk this way and just give me a kiss. <laughs> Aha! There they are. <laughs> Felix and Chiba. I'm not gonna say two voices at once. They're alive. They're alive. What is this? Alex, what happened? Ah, well, you see. Let me tell you this story that we just played. <laughs> and yes, to be continued. That's why we saved for some save game plus. Well, not save game plus, but... Basically, what you do is you, uh... Don't you get a code at the end or something? 
There's some way that you... There's something you do with it. Oh, or maybe... I don't... I don't really know. I don't know how you do the save game plus with it, because basically, your clear data when you do Golden Sun Law stage will go over. But... Eh... I never really got that far that it really mattered. <laughs> no, I think I did get far enough that it mattered, but... I was playing on an emulator, so I couldn't do that. Um, but that's it, guys. Although we could do battle. <laughs> I actually, I don't think we can do that without a link cable. Oh, wait, maybe we can. Yeah, let's battle monster. Let's go. I forgot about this. This is just a mode where you can just battle for no reason. Like, just, you know, have some fun, I guess. Good luck! Yeah, good luck indeed. Let's go. I think they get harder the more you go. Yeah, it's just a bit of fun, you know? But that is it, and I think it is time to announce my next Let's Play. Which, I mean, if you don't know what my next Let's Play is, where have you been under a rock? Because... Okay, look at the- well, look at what day it is. <laughs> And look at what I've said in the past that I was going to Let's Play. It's October. Everybody knows what October means for video games. That means that it's time to play a scare game. And what scare game have I played before? Resident Evil. So what scare game am I going to play next? Probably Resident Evil. <laughs> I don't know. I'm I'm at a I'm at a crossroads. I want to do Resident Evil too. I could do uh, Paris I Eve. That's another future one that I want to do. It's gonna be blind, so it's gonna be fun, <laughs> like the last one. People are honking outside. Um. And if they keep honking, because that sounds like they were what they were going to do, I'm going to choke someone <laughs> but um no that, that's that's really it at this point like i'm just gonna go through this because i'm i don't think i've done that this that often just because it's kind of boring it's just you going up against monsters over and over like if you like fighting monsters over and over if you like don't like battle things like this it's fine but i mean i'm not really a fan of that i like I don't know, I like the story and I like the puzzles, that's why I really latched onto Golden Sun as a kid. I didn't latch onto the party, or the battle system, other than the fact that it was one of the only RPGs that I did play as a kid. So... Oh, uh, now we're fighting repeats, come on, give me something harder. Anyway, guys, um... Is there anything else I want to say at this, at this point? Like, that's... That's, you, like, if you guys have seen other my other Let's Plays, that's what I do. Like, at, at this point in the Let's Play, when I, everything's over and done with, I have this moment where I'm just like, is there anything that I've missed in all this time Let's Playing this game that I want to talk about at this point? And there is one thing that I want to bring up that I brought up briefly in an earlier episode, but I didn't really talk about it. I will not be doing... Well, I didn't bring up this part briefly. I brought it up very... Very sternly. I will not be doing a Let's Play of Golden Sun The Lost Age. Because I do not like that game. Um, I did not latch onto it as much as I did this game when I was playing it. And on top of that, it had a very very tedious boat travel system which just served to lengthen the game because it made you go back and forth unlike this game where yes in the beginning you go in a circle but it's still bringing you pretty much straight forward like you're still going to new places you're not passing by and being like oh I've seen this place five times already like maybe Lunpa's the only place that that actually happens 
And I guess, um... Not Lalavero, but Suhala, I guess? I think that's the name of the town, if you go to Crossbone Isle. But other than that... Oh, and the Venus Lighthouse, because you go back around in a circle. But other than that... And those, those have their places, that's the other thing. Those have their places. Those work, because... It's showing you what you're gonna need to know later, <laughs> and then it comes back. Lost Age does it. It becomes tedious, it becomes artificial game lengthening, and it's not fun at that point. So I will not be doing an, a Let's Play of Golden Sun the, the Lost Age at any point. Ever. It is done. I will, however, do one more video. Because I have one last thing with this series, Golden Sun, that I want to share with you guys. So wait for that. Oh, sorry, keep your eyes open for that. I don't know when it's going to be out. It might take a while for it to come out. But it will It will eventually be out. Um, and in a way, it will be much more special than this Let's Play. <laughs> Alright, I think I've taken long enough explaining myself. Because <laughs> I feel like we've been going on for like a good 10 minutes after the Let's Play has ended. I'm just going through this at this point. I'm not even doing anything, I'm just spamming the pack. So I'm going to let you guys off after this battle is done. Just after this battle is done. Just one second. I could probably use the speed button to just go right through this, but I'm not going to do that because I don't... I don't like doing that. I don't want to speed up footage. Because it's... it's not Let's Play. It's... no. We're good. Yeah, we, we kill nine monsters. That's good. Anyway. Thank you, everyone, who's joined me for Let's Play Golden Sun. And I hope you enjoyed parts of it. I hope you enjoyed most of it. Um, and I hope you might consider coming back for more. in More Let's Plays in the future. In any case, I will bid you all adieu. Bid you all adieu. Bid you all slan. Bid you all... I want to say ahoy, but I think that's the Romanian uh, hello. <laughs> And see you next time. Take it easy, guys. Oh, man, this actually... This music's actually pretty nice. I think I'm gonna just, like, let it play for a little while. Because I don't usually hear it go this long. And I'll just have it fade off in a while. Alright. But I'm done. See you guys.